What's up guys? I'm Chris with DeVille Magic and today you're watching a magic recommendation. Welcome to the channel and thanks for tuning in. If you're new here and you're watching from YouTube, hit that like, subscribe and notification bell so you don't miss a video. Uh, this is a little bit different than, than my normal videos. This isn't a review. Not It's not an in-depth review. This is a recommendation. And normally, I tell you um, that to tune in for a new review every week or, or head over to DeVille Magic if you're watching from there and, and tune in for a new review every week. However, I haven't been keeping up with my reviews as stated in the video the previous video to this, I've had a lot of things going on um, in life right now, and uh, I'm working on learning some stuff for the reviews, some downloads, and then some other other uh, product reviews. So anyway, what I thought I would do right now, since this involves no prep work or it doesn't require me to learn anything, I still wanted to put out some content. And since the uh, since we're in the holiday season right now, I wanted to do a magic recommendation. So this goes out to anybody who is wanting to start learning magic, learning and performing magic, or anybody out there who, who knows somebody who may be interested in becoming a magician or has kids that, that show an interest in magic. And this is a kit, okay? We're looking at uh, how to be a magician kit by Illusionist. Uh, this is what I wish I had when I was a kid. So I'm going to show you what's what's inside the box. I'm going to go through what you're going to learn, or I'm going to go through a portion of what you're going to learn. I'm not going to go through everything because there's a ton. Uh, when I was a kid, I got my first magic kit when I think I was, I don't know, seven, seven or eight years old. And at that time, uh, I got a lot. There were a lot of tricks. You know, the, bo the box said... 130 plus tricks or 350 plus tricks I don't remember but it was a lot of really cheap stuff where you learn some basic principles but couldn't really go beyond that so I'm gonna go through this um, uh, yeah let's just get into it so you have the how to be a magician kit now inside it may not look like there's a lot okay um, you have your sponge balls you have some IT, you have a, um, I'm not going to say the name of this just because uh, I don't want to, it, it would tip off the method and I'm not doing exposure, but uh, this is a coin that allows you to perform coin bite or coin and bottle. This is a pull. Now I'm going to get into this a little bit more. Here is a special sharpie okay. here is a paddle and then you also get a tt which uh, a lot of people will know what that is but if i show it that will also be exposure even though it's the most exposed magic gimmick out there um, so that's what you get now I'm just going to go through some things. Uh, the quality is good, but it's not great. Um, I'll, I'll tell you, this is great to learn with and great to start performing with. But what I would do is I would, um, I don't want to say upgrade because it's just a preference, but I would switch these sponge balls out to super soft sponge balls. Um, the coin I would switch out or I would upgrade to something by Roy Coopers the pole what I did with this or what you can do with it this is a cigarette pole so it will vanish it will allow you to do a complete vanish of a cigarette um, not a lot of people smoke these days or definitely not as many as as they used to so it could be more difficult to find somebody with cigarettes um, and if you're a kid performing it might not be the best idea to to do something with cigarettes. So uh, what you can do with this is you can line the inside with 
like tape or or a bandage or something um, that will allow it to to uh, grip like a sharpie, which is something that you would be carrying on you or you can find lying around a lot of places, sharpie or a marker. Um, the paddle, I have had a lot of great experience with um, the turbo stick by by Richard Sanders. So I would upgrade to that. But anyway, what you get here is good. It's not it's not crap. It's not uh, it's you know it's it's very workable. Um, the ad copy also says that you get a deck of I think it's Black Ghost playing cards. However, every review that I have read, um, they didn't receive the cards, and, and I hadn't either. Uh, you will need a deck of cards to perform a lot of the material that is on these discs. And this here is where I think this kit really shines. So what I would do, um, if you're going to be buying this from Illusionist, I would pick up a set of cohorts. Um, you know, I... The fact that they didn't include cards uh, didn't wasn't an issue for me because I already have a ton of cards, and I mean most people have cards lying around the house, so it's not a huge downfall. But if you're if you're picking this up from Illusionist, pick up a set of cohorts. These are really good quality, and uh, it's actually a marked deck. So you know normally I just perform with bicycle cards, but while you're on the site, you might as well pick up a deck of cohorts. You're going to be able to do a lot with these cards. Now, to get into, I think, where this kit really shines is... Oh, my alarm's going off to wake up, but I'm already awake, so... Anyway, that might happen again here. Okay, so you're going to get a few discs... You also get some downloads if you are if you have an account. Uh, if you're buying this for somebody, then they won't have the downloads unless you download them on like a flash drive and give it to them. Uh, but you do have the discs. Now, I'm just going to read off some of the things that you're going to learn. This isn't all of it because when I looked at the track list and I I throw out my um, DVD cases because I keep all my DVDs in binders and I'm never getting rid of them, so. Anyway, I don't have the cases, but some of the things that I noted that you're going to learn are things that I think really stand out and things that I still use today when performing for people who want to see magic or when I'm even at uh, strolling, strolling events where I'm getting paid. Um, that's the nice thing about this is you're going to learn a lot of basics. You're going to learn a lot of different principles and it allows you to expand far beyond what's just in this kit. Um, so you're going to be able to go somewhere, pick up a deck of cards, and perform some great magic. You're going to be able to go somewhere, pick up some rubber bands or some um, bunch up some paper napkins and do some really great magic. So anyway, this first disc here goes through all the props that are included with the the kit. So it's going to explain the props and it's going to give you some some routines to do with them. And then, oh, actually, I'll, I'll let you know what those are. So, actually, I already, I already, it basically, it's just a track list of what's in here. Explain how to use each thing. Anyway, um, so then you got these two discs, and you're going to learn a lot here. I just have a few things that I wrote down that I wanted to, to touch on, but you're going to learn Out of This World, which is a, a really neat... Uh, card routine where your spectator makes the choices on which pile cards go into. And normally I don't like dealing out into piles. I'm not a huge fan of those kind of tricks. But uh, when it comes to your spectator making all the choices and then they have successfully created a what turns out to be a pile of all red and all black, I think that's a really powerful effect. Um, you're going to learn the crisscross force, which for me, is one of the most deceptive forces out there and it allows you to branch off into some really powerful mentalism. 
Uh, so it's great on its own and you can use it for much more. Um, you're going to learn a lot of different flourishes with uh, cards, coins. You will learn slights with cards and coins. Um, some co really cool coin vanishes like the retention vanish. Uh, you are going to learn the revolution coin vanish, vanish which used to be on a standalone disc. I, I forget what the price of that was, but probably it, it probably costs half as much as this whole kit. So that's right. That's cool. Um, you're going to learn a peak, fermentalism. You'll learn a coin bend, which is also used in a lot of mentalism or like uh, kind of telekinesis. Uh, I don't know. But uh, so that's cool. You're going to learn Crazy Man's Handcuffs, which is probably the most well known. To magicians not to lay people but the most well-known rubber band trick where a rubber band penetrates another one so that's a really good trick um, and it's nice because you can find rubber bands in a lot of places and this will look like it's done impromptu uh, so some of the card tricks card to mouth two card transpo triumph ambitious card two card monty card to pocket and waving the aces uh, though that's just a few there's there's a ton of card tricks on here but those are card tricks that I have had really great reactions with and a lot of these ones I'm still performing today so you know well, you learn these and you're going to be using them forever and then we have professor's nightmare which is a really great rope routine um, they have a stopping your pulse effect and then angle z which is where you tear the corner off of a playing card and that corner will then vanish and appear anywhere that you want it to. And then the spectator can see that the, the corner matches you know, the card where it's been torn. Uh, so yeah, you're getting a lot here and, and so much more than what I just listed, but those are the things that really stand out to me because if you learn those early on, like I said, you're going you're gonna to use those forever. So I think the price on this is $89, which to some people may seem like a lot, but you're likely paying about half of that with some of the really junky magic kits out there that you know, allow kids to learn a trick, but not really expand. And they're, they're going to grow out of it. They're not going to use it. You know, it's kind of like they'll use it while they are excited about the kit and then it'll kind of fade away. So one example of that is when I had my first, um, magic kit there, what I know now to be the cups and balls was at that time in this kit, cups and bunnies. So you had three, different plastic cups there was a yellow red and a blue and then some sponge bunnies and you cause the bunnies to penetrate through the cups now that was neat but that was the only only phase you learned and unlike the cups and balls you couldn't really do much more with that i mean now nowadays i i could come up with i guess other things to to incorporate with those props but as a kid i just learned what was what was uh, in the instructions and that was the end of it. So the nice thing with this kit is you're learning fundamentals, you're learning basics, you're learning slights and, and all these other things that will allow you to perform magic anytime, anywhere, either with the included props or with things that you find lying around. So that's awesome. Everything is uh, really well, well done. These, these discs are awesome and you're being the tutorials are done by some really great magicians out there. So you're going to you're going to have some good good teaching and you're going to have a lot to to do if if you are just starting out in magic or if you are gifting this to somebody. Anyway, this is running on to uh going to be 15 minutes, so uh I just kind of wanted to explain a portion of what's in here i think it's a really really great kit if you're starting out this is in my opinion probably the best that you can get i don't really have anything else to say on it except go check it out any kid who gets this or a person starting a magician will will be grateful so thanks again for watching and check back for more content i will be getting back on track 
as soon as things kind of slow down and I get everything straightened out. And I got some other things coming up that are that are really neat. Um, I'm going to leave that as a surprise. But anyway, thanks for tuning in.